Liga. Liga? Liga. Liga. Examine it. Yeah? Go like this. Go like this. Go like this. Oh, don't break it. Watch. Thought I broke mine. Uh, check that one out. Make sure that one's all right. Good? Watch. Pointer finger, thumb. Pointer finger. Drop it behind. Attach my thumb. This one's here. They're behind each other, right? Can't go this way. Can't go this way. Can't go this way. Melts right through. I'll do it again. This one's here. This one goes behind it. Yeah? See. Can't go this way. Can't go this way. Can't go this way. But when I'm doing it, people are like, man, that guy's just moving really fast, right? If it happens in your hands, it must be magic. Fingers like guns. Guns. Show me guns. Curl them in. You're the hooks. Definitely on there, right? I'm gonna drop it on your side. Can't go this way, can't go this way, can't go this way. What? Oh. All right, how you did? <laughs> That's crazy how you did. <laughs> You're late, man. Show's over. Wow. <laughs> you guys are over. Awesome. Welcome to Mexico, my magician, my favorite magician, right? Nice. <laughs> there you go, there nice. you go, dude. See Take you care. People always ask how I balance my family life with 400 shows a year. I'm just doing what I love with the people I love. It's my magic life. Hard to breathe. <laughs> what do you think? It's just a tad bit windy. Oh my gosh. I, it, it's like hurricane weather. Uh, this is how the weather people feel when they're, you know. You can't think. Natalie, look. It's a cute little elephant. They did give us a cute little elephant. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's cute. Aww. Aww. He's extra cows. Did you have a good day today? 
Did you have a good day today? Yes. It was fun. What is this? I see champagne event. Yeah, you are specially invited to be one of a few selected VIP guests at our Ladies Night Out Champagne event Monday evening, 745 at the Epi Boutique on deck number 8 forward. Just sit by their booths like in the United States. They get out there and sell it. Alright, stay strong, baby. <laughs> I like it. This one, Moni, come on. Here we go. I'm good. Say yes to the camera. Say yes to the camera. Hola. You want to go? I'm good, man. Thank you, though. Yes. I'm good, buddy. I'm good. Good prices. I'll be back. I'll be back. <laughs> I like it. Welcome. All right. Uh, today we're going on a tour to Sibyl Chaltun. Awesome. Your turn. Sibyl <laughs> Chaltun. That's very good. That's All right. Very good. Okay. All right. Close I enough try. for a white girl. <laughs> Thanks, honey. <laughs> Or you can try also the hibiscus tea, the hibiscus iced tea, okay, which is really healthy, okay, and today uh, they're going to give you two taquitos of cochinita pibil, this is, uh, you know, pork, 
uh, marinade and sour orange juice with, with a special ingredients and aromatic herbs. Okay, two taquitos, you know, the, the corn tortillas, handmade tortillas, so you get two taquitos of uh, cochinita pibil, pork, marinade and sour orange juice, and you get pollo pibil, chicken in pibil style. He can't go? Oh, he's yeah, going to go along. Yeah. Thank you. What a gentleman. Wow. Look. Wow. There's a nice breeze. Woo. Yeah, Chichen Itza was so hot. Awful. <laughs> That one is the mythical temple of the seven dolls. D O L L S. Comprende? Mm -hmm. Dolls. The name is after a discovery. You know, when the archaeologists were restoring the building over there, they found an offering jewels, ceramic, pottery, and seven little figurines out of clay representing some of the Mayan gods. Miniature, small, okay? And after the figurines, the seven, the archaeologists called the Temple of the Seven Dolls. That is the oldest Mayan temple in the Yucatan Peninsula. Not the oldest in the Maya land, the older ones in Guatemala. The ones, you know, uh, where the Maya civilization got originated. The origins of Maya, as in what today is Guatemala, okay? Very good. And in that building over there, you can see the door in the middle mm -hmm. and two windows, right? Mm -hmm. Well, every year, March 21st and September 21st, the days of equinox, spring and fall, early in the morning, okay, at the moment of dawn, we can see this beautiful alignment. Mayan people, more than 2,000 years ago, built this temple with such a precision to get the alignment of the sun in the days of equinox. And on each window, there is an alignment. But you know, on the left side, it's in June 21st, and then December 21st is on the right side, you know? Four alignments every 91 days. And you know, after each equinox, when it's the first full moon night, after each equinox in March and in September, when it's the first full moon night, we can see this. <laughs> Take a look at this beautiful. Mayans were very good astronomers. They study, they study the stars, the sun, the moon, planets, constellations, and they make calendars out of this observations okay this area here was the main plaza back in those times we think the building over there was the royal palace where the rulers live for generations and the family it looks like a like a fortress like a fort and that is true originally at the top were chambers that were the dormitories but underneath the steps there are inner chambers sometimes were used as shelters in case of hurricanes or in case of wars to other groups to other people so that was the palace for the rulers this one here was a residence you can see the rooms you can see like a garden here in the front Okay, uh, important families living in the main plaza. And right here, there is a pyramid that was used also as a temple. Mayans uh, were very religious and superstitious people. So, and uh, they used this. Uh, we don't know many things about Sibyl Chaltun. Apurnadi, the records about this place got lost. And also when the Franciscan monks came, to this place, you know, to build this church and to teach the Catholicism to the native Mayans. They burned 
the Mayan manuscripts. Mayan people have, like, you know, scrolls with the hieroglyphics, writings. But you know, the, the, the monks burned everything. So we lost the history of Tzibil Chaltun. Okay? In the Maya language, the words Tzibil Chaltun are actually three Mayan words. The word Tzibil, it means writings. Chal, it means on. And Tun, it means stone. So writings on stone is what Tzibil Chaltun means. Okay? Mayan people said enough is enough. They organized armies in the south of Yucatan near the border to Belize and the Mayan people fought a war for independence the last 11 years. In the year 1847, Mayan people gathered independence. And during this war, they destroyed, you know, the Mayan armies, some of the churches, convents, monasteries, and cities built by the Spaniards in earlier times. Okay, this was a really bloody war, Maya against the Spaniards. Okay, and this is when they destroyed this church. Come to see the facade. What was the main altar? All right, Natalie. Am I in pedicure? You gonna do it? I'll stick my feet in, but I might take them out pretty quick. We'll see. Let's go check it out. What, dude? Hey, Ben, you wanna see? Look at them all coming. They're hungry. All right, you go first. Honey, what do you mean? Go ahead. Stick just stick your feet in. I'm scared. You said you were going first. Come on. No, I never, I never said that. I just Natalie. Down. Natalie, go. I never said I People was going are, first. Come on. Go ahead. Well, who, I want to make here. sure they don't eat your feet off before I stick my feet in. <laughs> I got it. It's clear on this side, sweetie. You can see all the way down. I don't know if my short little legs will reach the water though, that's my thing. Well, sit over here, it's a little further down. Go ahead. Right there. Uh. Uh. Ew, look at them swarm you. Are they touching you yet? Yeah, but I'm not feeling anything. Oh, there they go. Are they doing anything? No. They're swimming and hitting my feet. I don't have enough dead skin in my feet, I guess. Or they're full. Oh, I'm scared. Here. Is it cold? I thought I had one on top of me. It's a leaf. Is it cold? That's cool. Okay. Ooh, ah, it is cold. You want to sit there and I'll sit here? Nothing. Woohoo! He hit my head. Hey, they're not doing anything there, sweetie. Yeah, they're not touching. Their heads hit you. These fish are full. They've already had tourists today. Boy, when they hook on though, it's like a it's like a sucker fish. All right, let's go do it. We get to do this one, baby. I said let's go in the middle. They have a little archway. See what that is. Maybe we can keep going up top. They said that's where they go to uh, hide from hurricanes and war. Down here? Yeah. Oh, that's the and entrance the inside. The bedrooms are upstairs, right? Up top? I guess. That was just the castle. The royalty lives here. Jeez. Didn't think that big rock was going to move. <laughs> Did you like that? Are you the queen of the castle? Bow to your queen. I am right. entering the castle. These are big steps. Let's do it. Urgh. Oh my gosh. Huge. These people have but a steel. You want to go in there? I don't. Yes, I do. <laughs> Come on. Go ahead. Are you afraid he's going to follow you?
This is not the best. Oh, you can't go anywhere. It's locked. Hey. They got the guard gate up. I know. You weren't worthy. No room. Huh? No, the queen is not supposed to be in the dungeon. I'm just going to turn that to the dungeon. <laughs> You're just going to pretend? Yeah. That's the dungeon. That's why they won't let me in. Okay. You can't go up any higher there. Down. Well, don't fall. They'll close this off to other tourists. Well, I'm not going to try to. Uh. Uh. Oh my goodness. That's not a step. <laughs> <laughs> That's longer than my leg. Uh. I need steps for the step. Yeah. That's a huge. Oh, that's over two feet, I'm you sure. Did? I know. Ow. Oh, is it over there? I don't know. Let me go in front of you. Okay. I don't think that was a iguana. If it was, he was a fast one. Wow, this is really neat to be able to explore up here, Nat. Yeah. But look at this. That's just straight down. You think that was somebody's room? No, oh, it's bigger than our cabin and our boat. I know. It seems bad. Yeah, this is easy. It doesn't seem as high. Never mind. There's still jumps. Ugh. How you doing, honey? That's big steps. Let me take watch you do a couple. Oh jeez. Like a... Are they a foot and a half each? I don't know, they're big. <sighs> Get my leg up to one. Take a picture? I don't know, how far is that? More than a foot, isn't it? It's gotta be. Yeah, I don't think so. Alright. Now we do the big well, boy. Let's go do that one. Oh my. That one's higher than the one we were just on. I know, but let's do it. I'm a little scared. I'm not ashamed to say it. Alright, let's take this one. Can you buckle one of them? Alright, you start over here. Be littler. Okay. I'm not going to be it wasn't ever its friend. Well, these aren't as steep, but boy, they're narrow. Straight. Hey. I'm gonna be scooting down on my butt. We got another level. What's the Rocky theme song, Dad? Going it? Look at. Here you go. Look at the city back there. Woo! Hey, Adrian! <laughs> yeah. These trees with the blossoms on top and the way they look reminds me of like African pictures and stuff I've seen. Like the flat. Yeah. Look at that over there. Yeah, it's neat looking, that looks like something Bob Ross painted. Ha <laughs> 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 hey, ha 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 Up. No, but he just talked about that. Over there is the governor's All right. house. This over here is the mayor's house. Or major. 
You said major, but I'm wondering if that's mayor. Where's the shopping? Is it through here? And this is the oldest cathedral. What is that? Second oldest or oldest? They I took don't know. Mayan. It's very old. They took Mayan pyramid and built it. Okay. Oh, that's right. Mayan pyramid built this cathedral here. And here it is. But it's closed today. Uh, well, no, it's just closed right now. It's closed to because they're having a siesta. Oh, so you didn't if we hear got that. here later. No, I guess not. No. From two to four is the hottest of the day, so that's when they have lunch and siesta. Oh, so there's that. Pretty. Have at it, babe. Don't go right. out. <laughs> nice. nice. What time is siesta over? Ah, uh, but we have to be back on the bus in 15 minutes. Is it comfy? It's all right. You think you could go to sleep like that? It's easier this is for than one person. I have for two person. I have family size. Wow. This is easier than the, uh, the cruise ship to sleep on. Yeah. Your turn. I'm good. I have in color. There's a line. Very neat. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thanks, buddy. Gracias. You were awesome. Thanks, man. Yeah. I'm going to try out that hammock thing. All right. All right. All right. All right. What I know? What I know? Hey.
another child animal. What's tonight's theme? I don't know. What's the night? What the heck is that? Long neck dinosaur, maybe? Either that or a giraffe. It's got cute little eyeballs. I'm not sure. A giraffe or a long neck dinosaur? They got rid of our They left one. our whatever that is and they took our elephant. I liked our elephant. But baby, look, they took the eyes off the elephant and put it on that thing. Oh. I wonder uh. if they made our whatever this is, long neck dinosaur slash giraffe. From our elephant. They could have just left the elephant. I like the elephant better. Do you like the elephant? I think the elephant was cute. Elephant was my favorite. Mm. Uh -huh. Maybe you can leave a note and request. Please make an elephant for me. 